My name is Dr. Andres Cardenas. I'm a consultant at Barna Clinic, and I work in the area of gastroenterology, hepatology, and digestive endoscopy. In addition, I'm an associate professor of medicine at the University of Barcelona, and I'm also a consultant at Hospital Clinic at the Institute of Digestive Diseases. Cirrhosis is a chronic liver disease characterized mainly by fibrosis and scarring of the liver, and it also is associated with dysfunction of the liver. The main causes of cirrhosis include hepatitis B, hepatitis C, steatohepatitis, which is fat infiltration of the liver, alcoholic liver disease, and metabolic diseases such as autoimmune hepatitis and primary biliary cholangitis. The treatment of cirrhosis depends on the cause. Those patients that have hepatitis B or C require antiviral therapy that can decrease their fibrosis and inflammation. In those with alcoholic liver disease, abstinence is important because it can also decrease the degree of fibrosis and inflammation. And in those with uh, steatohepatitis or fat infiltration of the liver, these patients require weight loss and exercise. In addition, those patients that have metabolic diseases such as autoimmune disease require in many cases drugs such as steroids that can decrease their inflammation. Finally, in those patients that have very advanced cirrhosis with decompensation, those patients require an evaluation for liver transplantation. Liver transplantation should be considered in some patients with chronic liver disease or cirrhosis. In those patients with cirrhosis, it should be considered when they develop complications such as fluid retention in ascites, renal dysfunction, change in mental status or hepatic encephalopathy, gastrointestinal bleeding due to portal hypertension, and liver cancer. Thank you.